as I'm observing the top of the buildings in Chicago and as I'm thinking about the documentary I saw about the so-called Lake Michigan Mothman makes me wonder to think if this entity is real and while I may never find the definite answer I'm prone to think that there is something that is hiding behind this demonic being especially according to so many eyewitness reports not just in Illinois but especially in West Virginia and after speaking with Pastor Josh and Ward in their investigation of their uh, local principalities and demonic encounters and after uh, rewatching the old classic with Richard Gere, Mothman Prophecies, I've been thinking more about this entity and just wondering, could it be that the city of Chicago and the state of Illinois and the whole Michigan lake is being visited and indwelled by this entity that we call Mothman? Of course, this creature, if it exists, has different names. And as while I'm thinking it may be cool to witness such a being on the other side, I'm also hopeful that that may never happen if I'm just being honest with myself. Sometimes, just after watching the documentary of the Lake Michigan uh, Mothman, when I go back home late at night, on a night like this, Sometimes I watch on the top of the buildings, observing if there is something out there hiding. And this short video is serving as an introduction to the coming episode of this weekend where I'll be having a couple of guys and we'll be talking about cryptids and different monsters and entities. But the question resounds in my mind and in my heart. Could Mothman and the legend of Mothman be true? Is there some evil entity behind this name? And even if there is, could there be more than just one? Just for example, like in the Gospels and the Legion, it wasn't just one demon, it was multiple. You know, I tried um, contacting Tobias, who is one of the guys involved in the documentary of the Lake Michigan Mothman, and he never responded. And even though he's not a Christian, at least I don't think so, I wouldn't mind having someone like that, someone who is an honest researcher and a professional in his area, who can come on the channel and, you know, just share his thoughts and ideas. If you guys know how... I can get in touch with him or if you know any other research on these topics please feel free to comment in the section under the video and just you know please put some names and how I can get in touch with those people I would like to occasionally investigate about these things but not when it comes to the speculative part only I would just like um, the channel to stay on the more professional and academic level with um, as, much, as, as much as I can provide sources and um, verifiable sources and of course some eyewitness reports and less on speculations. So yeah, this was just a short video. Enjoying this late Chicago evening, September. It's almost October. Enjoying some beautiful view. Wow, you can see this, right? And just thinking about Mothman, how frightful is this entity? If we can believe the book that John Keel wrote, if we can believe the movie, if we, if we can believe the documentary, then this is not some regular demonic creature. This is a much powerful entity, maybe even a principality. And if it exists, why is it in Illinois now? Did it migrate or there are plenty of them now? There are people who swear they witness um, many sightings on the local O'Hare airport. 
and I don't know what to think about it. I just find it fascinating and frightening at the same time. And again, I would like to interview some of the people who either witnessed or researched about this phenomena. And yes, this will serve as a wonderful introduction to the coming um, YouTube live session this Sunday. So stay tuned. There are many amazing and um, interesting things coming on the channel. I appreciate all of your um, shares, likes, subscriptions. And yeah, if you guys have any connections or any recommendations when it comes to the names that can come and be my guest, I would love to take that into consideration and, um, you know, just start thinking bigger and developing more the channel and covering those topics that are so difficult to hear today in um, Christian academia and churches. But again, I don't want to just bring anyone and I don't want just pure speculations. I would like people that are trustworthy and people who have been researching and um, who are just trustworthy. They can be Christians again or non-Christians like Tobias. That's okay. I'm willing to have friendly conversations with all of them. But yeah, this will be probably the ending of this short video. I hope you have enjoyed the site, the location where I'm at as much as I can, even though this video is not fairly portraying what I'm experiencing now. But yeah, please let me know. Do you sometimes wonder when you're late at night, enjoying your backyard or maybe flying in a plane on a plane or if you're in the woods, do you sometimes have these thoughts? If there's something high observing me, do you get chills? What is happening on your mind? Okay, guys. God bless. Take care. Stay tuned.